Hi, Nick Perdomo, president of Perdomo Cigars. So you just purchased some great cigars. What are you going to do with them? After purchasing your cigars, many of you like to age them in your humidors for an additional time, and there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. As a manufacturer, the most important thing for me when I'm going to, prior to making a cigar is I'm going to make sure that I pick the right plot of land that's extremely fertile. After I grow that tobacco, I'm going to cure that tobacco, ferment it, and age that tobacco. Once we age the tobacco and pick the blends that we're going to make, we're going to pass it on to one of our master artisans who are going to roll those cigars to perfection. And then after that, they're going to go into an additional aging period when the finished cigar is going to be aged for an additional 6 to 12 months in our Spanish cedar aging rooms. What's that going to do? That's going to guarantee that all those flavors marry together and it's going to be bursting with flavors once it's box banned in cellophane and sent out to market. If you decide you need additional aging on your cigars, like I said earlier, it's perfectly okay. However, remember that as you continuously age those cigars biochemically in those bunches, they are going to start mellowing. And what happens is the resins and oils start dissipating, which is just a natural product that happens during the aging period. So with that being said, it's a lot like a gas tank. If you're full, or let's say full-bodied, and we make a cigar that's full-bodied, if you keep that cigar in your humidor, let's say for an extra year, that cigar will start mellowing and becoming three-quarter or medium to full-bodied. Let's say a cigar was medium to full-bodied and you left that in the humidor for another year, for example. That cigar would become medium and so on. It, it starts mellowing, which is perfectly fine. So in reality, when you really look at it, cigar smoking is not only enjoyable and fun and celebratory, but you have to enjoy it. And if you like to mellow your cigars and you like to add additional aging periods to your cigars, that's perfectly fine. The important thing about cigar smoking is that we all enjoy our cigars. What happens if you notice your cigar is a little dry? That's where a good humidor comes in real handy because the great thing is you can actually recoup that cigar. What you're going to have to do is monitor it and when it's dry you're going to have to feel it to the tension that you like. So depending on the time where that cigar comes back and recoups is how long you're going to keep that cigar in the humidor. But the great news is you're going to be able to enjoy that cigar. One final thing on aging cigars. A poorly made cigar with inferior tobacco in your humidor will never become a better cigar. It just won't. But if you purchase a great cigar and you want to add additional aging to the cigar, I guarantee you one thing. It will be more mellow, but it will always be a great cigar. So I hope this information helped you out on aging. And if it did, please hit your like and subscribe button. And thank you for joining our YouTube channel. Hi, this is Nick Perdomo. I just want to thank every one of you for watching all our YouTube videos. I enjoy it very much giving you the information of what I love, which is cigars. Please hit the like and subscribe button for future videos and about all the future stuff that we're going to be talking about premium cigars. Thanks again.